Hi, welcome to Facebook Conversion Pixel Tracking. Today we'd like to show you how to get a basic Facebook Conversion Pixel set up and how to plug it in to your SunFrog Manager page to get the two to talk. So let's head over to the Facebook's Ad Manager and find the Conversion Tracking Pixel. And let's go ahead and create a pixel. So here you'll see a couple different options that we can set it for. Uh, for today's demo, let's just go ahead and set it to Checkout and let's name it Sunfrog Checkouts and create the pixel. Now that the pixel is created we can go ahead and view the pixel code and you'll notice a lot of different uh, code going on here and if you click the box it'll just kind of randomly highlight stuff but what we're looking for is this source here. We just want to grab everything between the quotes and hit Control C to copy. Now that that's done, you'll notice here that we have no activity on this um, and it's not active yet. In order to get this to activate, we have to go over to our Sunfrog Manager page and plug in that URL we just grabbed. Hit save. And go ahead and fire the pixel. And that's it. It's now set up. So if we refresh our page here, we will see that the checkout conversion pixel is now active. Now we can attach this to any of the ads we run and it will track the customers all the way to the checkout page uh, so we can see when they get there. Now the conversion tracking pixel can be used to monitor individual interactions that customers have with marketed links and it's a very powerful tool that we can be used to learn specific information about our consumer base as well as allow us to create really precise targeting.